guys, it's Kristen, and today I'm bringing you with me to the Take Me Red Carpet at Tribeca Film Festival. How is it being here for your it's first Tribeca? It's my first feature film. It's my um, first Tribeca experience, so I couldn't be more excited. Can you tell us a little bit about Take Me and, and where the inspiration came from? Sure. It's a. Um, it's kind of got a weird little logline. It's about a sort of like fledgling, bumbling entrepreneur who has a company where if I can pay him like three hundred dollars, he will kidnap you for eight hours. It's for sort of like thrill seekers and adrenaline junkies and people that kind of like want to get their rocks off with like a cool like interactive theater experience. And then it kind of gets in over his head when he uh, meets this client who may or may not be who she says she is. Um, it is a little, uh, a little crazy, and, or maybe not at all the person that contracted him to kidnap her in the first place. Now this film mixes like elements of slapstick comedy, like a crime thriller. How do you, how did you find that balance oh, God. in writing um, this? I think, I think you just sort of go with what feels more most organic, and, and uh, you know, I, I wrote it very much for Pat Healy, the, the star and director, and I kind of knew the space that he was most comfortable in, because I'd seen his previous films, Cheap Thrills and Rebels, and they were all sort of like, very sort of like sinister, dark comedies that also do have that more sort of suspense um, quality to them. What was this writing process like? Did it take a long time, or? Yeah, um, the process from script to film. Uh, it took about a year from when I first wrote it. I sent it to Pat as soon as it was finished, and, and uh, I'd kind of written it for him. We were friends. He, he really responded to it, and got uh, Mark and JT Floss involved, and Mel Eslin, and um, they knew Taylor Schilling, and it just sort of, the ball, once it started rolling, it didn't stop, and it was this, just the most surreal experience of my life, and about a year after I wrote the script, we were shooting it. That's awesome. Yeah. So you said you wrote this specifically with Pat Healy in mind. What is that? Like, do you write like that normally with someone in mind? Never, never. No, Pat was, but he's just absolutely incredible. He's one of my favorite actors. I uh, was fortunate enough to get to know him personally prior to writing the script. So when I did write it, I knew he was the one person I could maybe get to read it, and I've mean, just been such a big fan of his that it seemed like a no-brainer. And fortunately, he really loved it, and, and um, I just got really, really lucky. That's all I can really say. That's incredible. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Congrats on the film. I appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and click that subscribe button for more coverage from Tribeca Film Festival. See ya!